I really didn't expect to wear it. This face back here, that's not her. This, this doesn't look like her at all. Where's the personality? What is this? This is a different, this is a whole lot of different person. And the doll, she looks fine. You know, she's got that like sass or whatever. Her hair is also pinker than I thought it would be. It has like, I don't know, Halloween energy. Other than that, I like, I like her. She looks cute. I know a lot of people take issue with her skirt. I like the skirt. Um, and she has cat food, which is fun. And then we have a day out Frankie, which is exciting. Um, most, largely the same food as their cordal, but I think it's, I don't know, it's different. Have, oh my god, they're so frame. Look at that ring. That's so cool. I was wondering if the dress was a two-piece, like if it was a dress with that same undershirt as the cordon, or if it was a like one-piece thing. And it is two pieces. It looks like it's two pieces. Ooh, these earrings. I've been sitting here for a couple of hours, but other than that, where are they? Off to a good start. Feeling 22 or whatever. trying to get this food, this, this, this meal, this dish for 10 years. I've had it twice in the last 10 years, 11 years. And I love it so much. And there are finally Norwegian recipes available. And I'm so happy that cheese and bread. Oh no, my best friend. supper for my birthday and i thought i'd give you a little tour of it we've played on it since my birthday obviously but i thought i could give you a little tour of what it looks like i've said it's a peaceful just now because i didn't want to um tap out while recording and get a hit with anything um, but this is the skeleton place we can change that difficulty normal down here, a little enchanting spot, skeleton farm. This is what I call the maintenance entrance. We have some chests, um, stuff, and then this is just a cave bed here. I like to put a bed near my um, XP farms because going up that elevator and it being night is scary. So just having a bed nearby so you can like check that it's not night is nice. Here's just a cave entrance. And then we have cake everywhere, kind of. Um, these like almost fully eaten cakes are kind of all over the map. So on my birthday, I decided that I don't need food. Every time I get hungry, I will go give uh, a, a cake. And then everyone got cake. Um, so whenever I took damage, uh, I would just spawn in cake and my friends had inventories full of cake and it was like a funny little bit. And I think I'm going to do that again for my next birthday because I thought it was really fun. And now there's just random cake all over the place. <laughs> and this is my house. Um, it's not the prettiest house in the world, but I, I was looking at a village and these two houses were in front of each other creating what looked like a new type of villager house and I thought it was interesting. So I tried to make it the way that it like looked like it was. And this is that. So I have this little berry stuff. I have the crops here. Um, cake. I fish in this little pond. And that's that's the outside. In here we have 
just like a general little area. Chest, furnaces, glass furnaces, unsorted chest, tool barrel, old armor, you know, stuff. More storage down here is my mine. And then up here, I need to shift to get out, but it's fine. This is also mostly just a storage floor, like wood. This is the same chest as downstairs. Nether, stone, dirt, mob drops, and uh, random valuables. And then up here is the bedroom and food chest. I like to switch my like lunch of the day every morning. Um, so that's why it looks like this. I might need to expand this into a double chest soon because there's only one empty slot. Um, but we'll see. Now I have this so that I will automatically crouch. Whee! So let me show you this. Again, I have to crouch to get down here. Um, here's another cake. <laughs> There's another cake. This is on iron level. So this is how I mine for iron. This bone door uh, leads to the... Um, this leads to the skeleton spawner because I did find it through mining here. And then down here, which doesn't have proper stairs yet, more cake. Oh, there's just a hole. Oh right, we do a little turn. I thought I had a security block here. Okay, do a little turn, and there's cave for diamond mining. Um, but I have all the diamond I need, so I'm good. That's why this doesn't have stairs. And here's just cobble. Hmm. What do I show you next? I guess we can just follow the path. We can't go this way now. And here we have a sugarcane farm. My friend showed me how to make this. And it's also like we have this set up so that it is expandable if we want. But we haven't done that. Um, but yeah. Another elevator down. stuff. Uh, maintenance stair. And then up here is the clock, which I don't really understand. My friend explained it to me, but I don't understand redstone. Um, so this moves, right? Like that. And then that happens. It's waiting for these to move. So um, once one of these is empty, I think, they, they move the cobble around and once this is out of cobble this thing will something here will react and then it poops poop, and you can adjust the speed of it by adding more cobble or taking cobble out of it uh, which is pretty cool like I said I don't really understand it my friend explained it to me and I didn't really understand it But it's pretty cool. And then over here is a village. As you can see, another one of my friends basically lives here with the cakes and the cows and the sheep and the wheat. More cake. Um, more cake. And more cake. <laughs> um, yeah, I consider this my friend's village because they like got situated here with the cows. I don't know if they consider it their village, but I do. Most of my friends actually settled with their own village, and we're gonna go over here. This area spawns trident guys, and I've been meaning to try to get one. But I haven't really, like, prioritized it. And here we have another village, yay, and a big old farm. Berries. And 
trading hall. Wee. And a villager breeder. Yeah, the villager breeder is disguised as a house, so it's that thing, uh, which looks like other villager houses, except it has no door. Um, I tried to copy this one right here, but no door. So it just looks like this. But like if you walk past it, you're not going to think about the fact that this one has no door unless you're trying to uh, loot the village. So it doesn't look out of place is the point. There's not really a lot more to show you that isn't just like my friend's houses and I don't feel comfortable doing that without their permission. Um, there's the nether portal. Um, there's not really anything in the nether because like we've we've found the fortress. I don't know where it is. And the nether is mainly used as like a way to travel between our homes. But yeah, we haven't like gotten particularly far. Like there's not a lot of stuff here. We've gotten the dragon. We've killed that. But it's it's a very chill server and it's going to die in a couple days. That's kind of sad, but this is my birthday server. I hope you enjoyed the tour.